Okay, so you were, were you by yourself or? No, me and my wife. You and your wife? Yeah, okay. Yeah, we in the... Where were you? The storm cellar that I built. Oh, good Lord. Thank God you had one of those. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's, that's the only thing saved us. Uh... There we go. There we go. All right. There we go. All right. Let's clear a path here for her. And then have to go far, you know what I mean? There we go. All right, there we go. One more step here. Okay. We're going to have to step up on these bricks right here, okay? Yeah. You're doing good, though. There we go. There we go. Okay, be careful. There's a ledge right here. So I want you to be careful when you step down, okay? There we go. Yeah, my purse and my phone okay. is in there. Maybe back there was a shit back there. They're just going to make sure. There's a garage on the, like in the basement level on the other side of the house, but I think it's only open for them. All right. Yeah, let's just double check. Hello? What was your name and your wife's name? Donald and Karen Goodacre. Goodacre. Yeah. Donald and Karen. Yeah. Well, it was scareful. Yeah. And uh, it, uh, you know, my ears all stopped up, you know, you couldn't, ears were popping and stuff, you could hear stuff and everything. And uh, <coughs> it blows stuff plumbing underneath the door. Yeah. I thought it was going to blow the door open. But it was a steel door I'd put on there and reinforced it. So that was the only thing that they saved it. I'll tell you one thing. It's a good thing he built that. Because the basement itself wouldn't have saved us. This was a basement and a house on top. Wow. A nice house. Yeah, and there's nothing. No. How eerie is this for you to step outside and see this? It's awful. It's all just everything. But at least my dog's okay, my husband's okay. 